breaking input is coming in from the United States where a suspect in, uh, in mass shooting in Man had killed 18 uh, has now been found dead. Now at least 18 people were killed after a gunman went on a shooting spree in the northeastern state. Now manhunt for Robert Card had been underway since 18 people were killed and 13 others were wounded in the two shootings at a bowling LA and a restaurant in Houston men on Wednesday night. Now these are the latest information uh, inputs that we are getting in from the ground. Uh, now let's quickly take a look at uh, some of the reactions coming in on this report. I stand here to t tonight to simply report that the Maine State Police have located the body of Robert Card in Lisbon. He is dead. I've called President Biden to inform him about this news, but this discovery is entirely thanks to the hundreds of local, county, state, and federal law enforcement members from all over, and people from other states as well, people who searched <clears throat> tirelessly to arrive at this moment. And on behalf of all Maine people, I want to exp express my profound gratitude for their unwavering bravery and determination. Well, joining us on the broadcast is our colleague Abhishek Jha. Abhishek, uh, well, uh, after hours of manhunt, the suspect of mine shooting has been found dead. Now, do we have any more information or knowledge on how did the suspect die and where was his body found? Well, the body was found after 48 hours of that unfortunate incident where 18 people were killed and many more were injured. Uh, on the three shootings that like the three spots uh, he was found shooting people shooting at the people uh, now the police uh, initial investigation suggests that uh, the person died by self-inflicting wounds so probably uh, after killing so many people and hiding for a few hours he died by suicide but that is something that the uh, revelation will come after more investigation will happen into the, that case uh, the major part is that the entire town is in somber mood uh, this is the 566th shooting incident in the u.s this year that means about two shooting incidences mass shooting incidences happens every day and that is a major uh, larger concern that the u.s society is having as to how to stop that violence how to stop that negativity or uh, that, that that gun culture that is being uh, taken by so many uh, people who are mentally unstable and who uh, just pick up gun from normal shop and just go about shooting indiscriminately at the people and that is a larger problem in the u.s with this latest uh, killing in main city, uh, th this is also being talked about in USA now. Right, Abhishek. You rightly pointed out that there is a larger issue looming on United States where these mass shootings keep happening time and again. Now, let's quickly take a look at some of the reactions, more reactions coming on this story. I want to I want to say to everybody, thank you so much. You can our community can now breathe a sigh of relief, as as the governor stated, and I can't echo that enough. Um, our work again is not done here. Um, I, I was very elated tonight when I got the call from Commissioner Sawchuk um, advising me of uh, the revelation of what took place, and that Mr. Card is deceased and no longer a threat to our community or any other community. Uh, I just don't want to forget the, the families that are grieving and will continue to grieve. I don't want to forget the law enforcement officials that have worked tirelessly throughout this whole event uh, to come to a good conclusion. Um, our men and women of the Lewiston Police Department, of all of our surrounding agencies, this is, in, is vitally important to all of us that this conclusion came to light. We're going to grieve for the families that lost loved ones here. Uh, we're going to continue to work. We're going to persevere. Um, and we become better people for it.